Hi, it's Amy Holman. I'm going to read my poem, Bird Hearts Racing. This includes a note, uh, bird spelled B-U-R-D, Middle English from Old English, brid, bride, chiefly Scottish, a young woman. doesn't really have anything to do with the animal, but I had to put it in. Bird Hearts Racing. Already, chestnut-bellied finches know confinement held in men's hands, and confusing wind without their wing dips buffeted, when thirty-four are slotted in orange hair rollers, packed in a duffel carry-on, and flown to New York for bird racing. Not a contest of flight speeds, for wouldn't they always be taking it too far? undulating over each finish line and into canopies of the Parks Department's plantings? It's a competition of paired male songbirds, finches superior to any other, singing to win men thousands or hundreds, owners or betters. Bird emotions are controversial to some humans who specify these residual dinosaurs, yet the four-chambered hearts do allow fear. In Guyana, a man bicycles through heavily degraded former forest with a cinch in his fist. The engine of the heart ignites in the breeze, and wings agitate a palm. Man in a room plays a tape of the tees and tees of the last winning cinch, training his captor to sing the same best. Finches will want someone. They will tire of cover tunes. Where are their birds? These birds must wonder. Their perfected songs of prowess and pure love exploding in the quiet air. In the remaining forests, the shes tune their ears to untutored males, each pair enraptured by their specificity.